the day you plant the seed is not the day you eat the fruit. That's a random quote I took off the internet. This is Legacy Over Likes. I am Drew. I don't know who to uh, attribute that quote to, who to give credit to for that one. Uh, but I liked it, so I went with it today. Uh, today being day six of my 30 days of inspirational quotes, uh, I thought about going with the Bill Russell quote. You know, he's really the only like number six uh, as far as athletes that I could think of. Um, but I'm gonna be real, I actually was quite taken back when I started looking up quotes uh, for Bill Russell. I, it's some pretty deep quotes, and and a few of them were like in regards to like love and just life and and i was like man like and then i started read i just kind of started going on this this rabbit hole of like just bill russell and i was like all right you know what uh i'm gonna <laughs> i'm gonna look for something else uh, um um it's still a bit early today and uh and i was like yeah i'll maybe i'll save a bill russell quote for another time um because i really to, just to be honest with you, I just didn't want to like kind of half-ass a, you know, a, a story about Bill Russell because admittedly I'm not like the biggest Bill Russell guy, whatever. So anyways, let me get back on track here. Um, but I, I saw this quote and uh, yeah, I think I think there's a lot of people that could, could resonate with that, you know. Um, we live in a world where you know, a lot of us have short attention spans. You know, we're really not patient. A lot of people just, a lot of people just don't want to put in the work. You know, uh, they're they're constantly thinking right now. You know, we're in a right now type of world. You know, what have you done for me lately? I mean, look at look at fads. Look at you know how fast like something you know comes and goes. I mean, you hear like you know whether it's a song or a dance or a meme or whatever it is. It, it'll it, it's like a fleeting moment it's like it's there and then before you know it it's gone faster than ever and and um and so because of that you know everything that we do we we want like right now you know it's like it's like my son you know me and him you know we're starting this kind of this new routine we're trying to eat a little bit better and and work out and and he's like you know dad like you know i'm frustrated you know I, you know, I haven't lost enough weight yet. And I'm like, I'm like, kid, like, it's been like, it's been a couple weeks, you know what I mean? Like, calm down. Um, but that's, that's the type of mentality we have, you know, it's like, we want it right now. And, you know, and, and if he could just say, you know, hey, look, if I just keep this going, you know, a month from now, six months from now, a year from now, I could completely redefine my body, you know? But we're always thinking right now. And, and it's not just, you know, and, and weight loss aspects, but, but I mean, think about like business, you know? There's so many businesses that, that think right now and they get themselves in trouble because they're thinking right now and they're not thinking about the future, you know? There's a channel on YouTube that I love to watch, this guy, uh, the name of the channel is called The Company Man, and he breaks down, you know, these different companies and and their successes and failures, and so many of them, they just didn't forward think. They didn't think about, you know, the long term. It's always, you know, right now, and um, so so. Anyways, you know, uh, don't. Don't get caught up in the right now sometimes, you know what I mean? Um, I, I I guess I might as well just go sidetrack. I always go sidetrack anyways. I don't even know why I mention it anymore. If you follow me on this channel, you just kind of know that's what I do. I like to babble. But uh, but I've I've followed YouTubers that uh, that I've become fan, you know, I, I've become a fan of them. And, and if you've ever followed somebody on, on YouTube and you just really appreciate what they do, and you watch them start to climb and climb and climb. They gain subs and and um, admittedly, like there have been a few that that have kind of you know catapulted you know past me. And I was just like, man, like you're doing it, like you're killing it. And and I would be a little envious. And then they just disappear. It's like they just stop. 
And I'm like, what? Like, why did you stop? Like, why didn't you keep going? Like, if you would have just kept going, like, a year from now, where would you be? Five years from now, where would you be? And, um, and so many of us do that in life, you know, where, where it's just like we stop and we stop right at that moment, you know, where if, if we had just kept going, uh, and who knows what would have happened. And, and so for me, it's like, regardless of what I'm doing on this channel, you know, whatever, you know, route change I make, you know, whatever style video I'm doing, uh, I want to continue to do it no matter what. Um, I always try to remind myself of another quote, which eh, maybe I'll use that one. Uh, uh, but, but the first 10,000 photographs will be your worst. And um, that was a famous photographer that <laughs> I can't remember his name, but I remember in the, the first series that I did, uh, the 50 Days of Inspirational Quotes, I remember using that quote. And it's always carried with me because I always try to remind myself uh, not as a crutch and to say that it's okay for me to put out subpar content, but to say that, you know what, uh, as long as I'm learning something as I'm going along, uh, that I'm better off for it. And um, hopefully it doesn't take me 10,000 videos, but my first 10,000 videos, my first 10,000 whatever, that will be my worst, you know? There's always a process. Uh, you know, I, I think of Kevin Hart. Uh, <laughs> He's just somebody specifically that I heard talk about this. So I mentioned him and I've mentioned him in the past, but but he's talked about how like he spent like 16, it was like something crazy, like 16 years, like, you know, hustling, like, you know, as just this, you know, this actor that nobody knew who he was. And, and when you ask anyone, you know, what they think of Kevin Hart, they, you know, most people recognize him, they know who he is. But they don't see that struggle, all that work, you know, that the first 10,000 photographs he had to take. And and so, I don't know. I know I'm kind of going all over the place here. Um, and I really had planned on keeping this video super short because it's, it's just, it's cold outside today. Like, I'm telling you, like, I can't keep up with the weather in Charlotte. Like, it's like 39 degrees. And um, fortunately, the sun's getting ready to come up. It's starting to come up now, uh, so I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go for a run. I think I'm gonna switch it up though, and I'm gonna go back inside after I run, and I'll meditate then, because uh, I don't know that just sitting still any longer outside uh, is gonna work for me, because it's just a little bit too chilly. It's probably about 6:20 now, almost 6:30. Uh, so this is day two of me kind of getting up early. Uh, today I woke up actually even earlier than I wanted to, um, kind of threw myself off. I fell asleep a little bit earlier last night than I had planned on. And, uh, so that kind of fouled me up, but I'll get that, I'll get that under control and, um, kind of get myself on a normal pattern. But, uh, but that's really all I got. Just, you know, I guess for me, myself, and, and thinking about this quote is, is just having that understanding that, uh, you know, that, that the work I'm putting in today and what I'm trying to do today that I, you know, I, I may not see that immediately, you know, uh, come to fruition, but, but if I just keep putting in that work, that, then in the end, that it'll work out, right? And then that just goes back into trusting the process. So uh, that's about all I got. Uh, that was just another morning babble session from from Drew here. So uh, I'm going to keep grinding. I'm going to keep moving forward. I will always trust the process. I will talk to you all later. I'm out.